Welcome, collectors, and thank you once again for joining me for an all-new edition of Diecast Emporium. In today's very special edition, we are going to be reviewing a 164 scale by DCP by First Gear model. Specifically, this is the 2018 Freightliner Cascadia High Roof Sleeper Cab with a 53-foot utility dry goods smooth-sided trailer in the colors of the Halo Foundation, which is a memorial to the victims of of the passengers and crew of Flight 93. Now, I know most of us are well aware of the story of Flight 93, but for those that may not be, essentially, Flight 93 was the fourth plane that was hijacked and was to be used as essentially a guided missile um, to attack a target here in the United States on that day by Al-Qaeda. But by the time the Flight 93 was en route to its destination, a lot of the crew members and some of the passengers were made aware of what was going on around that country via cell phones, and a group of the passengers decided that they were not going to let this happen under their watch, and several of them decided that they were going to attempt to take back the plane from the hijackers by storming the cockpit, and essentially what they succeeded in doing without question was ensuring that this plane was not going to be used as a guided missile and was not going to kill more thousands of people on that terrible day. So by any stretch of the imagination, the passengers and crew on this Flight 93 are really the biggest heroes of September 11th, being that many of them were just citizens. They were not members of the military. They were not first responders. They were your average Joe businessmen and women who decided they were going to step up and make something happen. So Flight 93, the National Memorial, and 93 cents for flight93.org all are all over this truck. And as you can see, the box is different from the standard DCP by First Gear style packaging. You can see the American colors, red, white, and blue, along with some stars. 93 cents for flight93.org at the bottom, 164 scale special edition diecast collectible up on top, the same thing. Side flaps have Forever Heroes, Flight 93, Honor and Hope, DCP by First Gear, and on this side, again, the same thing. Taking a look at the back, 93 cents for flight93.org. Here we go. The Halo Foundation was born to honor the heroes of Flight 93. On 11th September 2001, the 40 passengers and crew on this flight fought back against the terrorists hijacking their plane. Soon after, Sharon Dietrich stepped up to serve the families and friends of those who sacrificed their lives for their country that day. She consequently made a commitment to perpetuate their legacy by telling students the story of courage and unity that was displayed on Flight 93. It was due to this commitment that Sharon began the Halo Foundation in 2003 as a nonprofit organization. Halo exists to develop students as servant leaders by recognizing specific overlooked needs in the community and illuminating the selfish example, selfless example, excuse me, of the heroes of Flight 93. Flight 93 inspired Halo's 93 cents for Flight 93 campaign and L-E-A-D-R. In addition to these programs, Halo continues to be involved in the disaster relief as well as other patriotic and nonprofit causes. There is the Halo Foundation's logo, as well as the victims and crew of Flight 93. And over here we have the Forever Heroes Honor and Hope Flight 93 National Memorial logo. Okay, let's get this thing out of the box. As all of us now should have goosebumps as I do, let's go ahead and unbox this thing. The first time that you unbox this model, you will have to navigate your way around several tapes that are used to house this truck between the two plastic pull-apart formers. But before we get to that, we do have a piece of paperwork that is provided with this set. So let's read this. 93 cents for flight93.org. Thank you for purchasing this 164 scale Freightliner Cascadia and 53 foot utility trailer diecast collectible. A portion of proceeds will be donated to the Halo Foundation. The Halo Foundation was born to honor the heroes of Flight 93. On 11 September 2001, the 40th 40 passengers and crew on the flight fought back against the terrorists hijacking their plane. You can see that the Halo Foundation's logo is at the bottom left, signed by Sharon Dietrich, the president and founder of Halo Foundation. And on the bottom right, it is signed by current creative director at First Gear Incorporated, Adam Knight. Very nice, beautiful certificate of authenticity included with this set. 
All right, let's get the truck out of the box now. As I said, it is held with these plastic tapes, so we will need to cut that. Allow me to do that, and when we come back, we'll have the truck out of the box. Okay, we have the tapes successfully cut. Let's lift the top part of the plastic former out. First out of the box is the Flight 93 Mural Memorial Trailer. Next out of the box is the Freightliner Cascadia Tractor or Truck. The only other thing inside the box is a bag containing a bunch of small pieces, including two small mirrors which need to be affixed to the truck here and here. All right, let's take a look at the tractor or the truck portion first. We can see that I have put the two side view mirrors on top of the engine cover. They just slide into those two holes that you saw previous to this. If you want to permanently display your truck out of the box, I would recommend adding a little bit of glue or some modeling putty so that you ensure these mirrors stay in and do not fall out and get lost. All right, taking a look at the decals on this truck, they are incredibly impressive, including the Bald Eagle mural. Grassroots America, honoring Flight 93 heroes, 93 cents at a time. Chrome work, excellent on this truck, as we have come to expect with DCP by First Gear Products in 164 scale, and the tires are rubber. Back of the cab has some coiled lines, which of course are not long enough to reach the trailer, but they are there just for aesthetic looks. They are not made to be functional. The mud flaps are black with some DOT decaling striping at the top, and we can see some lights at the back of the truck. There is a fifth wheel, but it is stationary and not made to slide in either direction, but that does mean that it will accommodate any of your first gear or DCP trailers. This side, very much the same thing. It bears mentioning again of this beautiful rendition of the Bald Eagle. Again, Grassroots America honoring Flight 93 Heroes, 93 cents at a time. The front of the truck has your Halo Foundation logo, your honoring Flight 93 logo, as well as, once again, 93 cents for Flight93.org. Your bumper or grill of the truck, again, beautifully in chrome with Freightliner right here at the top. The bumper, bottom part of the bumper is black and plastic. That is the truck. Let's take a look at the trailer now. The trailer is certainly the better of the two, even though both are eye-catching and impressive. This has several pictures of individuals that are either in class or outside. 93 cents for Flight93.org, National Memorial, again, Forever Hero, Honor and Hope, Flight93, an American flag logo. The back of the trailer has your Road Scholar Transport. Lining the bottom of the trailer, you can very clearly read and make out all of the victims of the crew and uh, passengers of Flight93 beautifully presented at the bottom of the trailer. At the back, we have again those same logos as we've seen many times before, along with 93 cents for flight93.org. We remember, we honor a national memorial for the Flight 93 heroes built one donation at a time. The doors will open on this trailer if you want them to, but again, this is meant just to be as a static monument in my opinion i would open this and put it in a display case i would not use this vehicle really in a diorama uh, or to be loading things into the back of but just note that that option is available to you as shown here with the opening doors the other side identical to what we've seen before with yet more photos again some more names and again 93 cents for flight93.org the national memorial Last part of this video will be showing the functionality of the cab of the truck and then joining them together. The truck rolls well enough on its own. It does have working steering at the front, seen here, and you can open up the hood to get a detailed look at the motor that is inside, and you can close it back up as well. Let's join the two together to see what they look like, truck and trailer together. Drop in the kingpin into the fifth wheel, make sure everything is lined up, and you have a complete truck and trailer set. Overall, this is a wonderful rolling memorial to the 
victims and crew of Flight 93. Obviously, it is for a great cause as well. I cannot recommend this truck enough. Also, it goes great with the newly released September 11th uh, Tunnels to Towers truck that I recently reviewed on this channel as well. So if you were to purchase both of these, they make a great pairing together. As always, I'm Tommy with Diecast Emporium. Thank you all so much for watching. Until next time, take care, be safe, be well. I'll see you in the next review.